qualified healers. Never really got that. Qualified healers. You're a healer. Right. Okay. Um, you've gone on a course. Perhaps for a long time. Perhaps you've gone on a crash course. It doesn't really matter. How do you know what works? People who believe in it, who are looking for some kind of healing, tell you that they get some kind of good feeling when they have the healing. You know, the idea of people throwing away their crutches when they needed them just to stand. I mean, that's rare, it's usually a matter of psychology, but you don't even have that most of the time. The average spiritualist, some, someone walks a bit better, someone breathes a bit easier, someone, I don't know, sees a bit clearer, whatever, you know? Someone who has an achy chest for whichever reason, say it's a heart condition, they feel an easing. A person who has any number of different issues, they might feel something's a bit better because they feel relaxed. There's a chemical release in the brain, they feel more relaxed. Great. And that is that. Is that really healing? It's healing of a kind. Is it actually healing anything physical? Or, you know, physical in terms of the brain, which would affect the mental. Is it actually doing something in terms of actual healing? Or merely through the art of bullshitting yourself? Are you releasing certain chemicals that make you feel slightly better than you were before? Because if that's true, that means all the, all, all the qualifications don't matter. They're all equally meaningless. Because a person might well get a good feeling with a person who pretends to be a healer. And they do. Or a person who's an obvious con man and shown to be an obvious con man. They get a good feeling with that person too. They go to a person who's supposedly genuine, but because they have doubts, they feel nothing. Or they don't feel the same energy. Or they don't have doubts, but they go, oh, I'm not used to it this way, and they don't get the same benefit. It's in the mind. So in that regard, should we even call anyone a healer? Unless they're a doctor, of course. In which case it's not healing, it's medical, you know, medical doctors. It's medical science as opposed to, well, woo-woo.